Hi there, Aquaba, and welcome. I hope you're doing awesome. So today, I will show you how I make my Ghanaian assorted fried dries. It's a quick and flavorful recipe made so simple. So join me and let's get cooking. Okay, so we'll begin by cooking our rice first. I've been told that using a day old rice is better, but I didn't have any. So we'll cook our rice with the appropriate amount of water until it's done. And remember, you don't want it too soft. So once it's cooked, allow it to cool completely. Cold rice is the secret to perfect fried rice as it holds the shape and texture better during the frying process. Next year, I have my washed vegetables. I will prep them and set them aside and will also make sure to cut them in bit sizes. And for my protein of choice, I'm using beef and chicken. So in my large pan, I will pour in about a tablespoon of vegetable oil. I then added the marinated beef to the hot pan and to marinate my beef, I used some ginger garlic paste along with some beef seasoning and salt to taste. And now I'll stir fry the beef for about five to seven minutes until it's brown and cooked through. Once cooked, I'll remove the beef from the pan, then set it aside. In the same pan, I'll add another tablespoon of vegetable oil. Then add the marinated chicken to the hot pan and I marinated the chicken with some ginger garlic paste, chicken seasoning and salt to taste as well. Once cooked through, I'll remove the chicken from the pan and set it aside with the beef. Next, in the same pan again, I'll add another tablespoon of vegetable oil. Then add my chopped onion. I will stir fry until fragrant, then follow up with my chopped carrots. And we will stir fry the carrots first because they take a longer time to cook than the other vegetables. So we'll cook them first to ensure they become tender and maintain a good texture. Next, follow up with my green bell peppers and we'll stir fry them for about one to two minutes here. I will also add some chicken seasoning to enhance the flavor of the fried rice here. It's totally optional though. Next, we'll now add the rice to the stir-fried vegetables. And if it's your first time coming across my channel, welcome. If you like what you're seeing so far, do me a solid and smash on that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. I'd truly appreciate it. Thank you so much. And I'll also add in some green peas and I love them in my fried rice. So we'll stir everything together, ensuring the rice is mixed well with the vegetables. And thank you to all my returning subscribers. I do appreciate the constant support. You guys are truly amazing. So I went in with some soya sauce and it has high sodium content. So be careful adding any additional salt. So at this point, you can add any seasonings if you prefer. Then stay well to combine. And now we'll combine everything together. So I'll go in with my scrambled eggs and then my beef and chicken. So guys, in Ghana, this is one of my favorite street foods, watch it being the first, of course. So anytime I crave it, I make my own at home. It's nothing compared to the street food, but it is as close as it gets. Okay, then so stir everything together until it's well combined and heat it through. And friends, this is how I make my Ghanaian fried rice. Super easy, flavorful, and quick to make. I hope you try this recipe and let me know how you did. Thank you for cooking with me and I hope you enjoyed and found the video helpful. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Let me know if you have any questions and please smash on that subscribe button if you haven't done so yet. And until next time, stay safe and blessed always.